And we're back. Yeah. Yeah. Had a little bit of a break again. Wasn't really intentional, but it kind of panned out that way for a number of reasons. But we're back. And I chose a great time to take a break because it was right when I finished not only this, this floor, but I also did my like maintenance episode where I went around and like got a new weapon, did some uh, research type things, and progressed in a few different ways and sort of cleaned up a bunch of stuff. So our next objective is to go to the recreation deck. So last time we got our crystal shard equipped finally. As far as I can tell, invalidating the wrench entirely. We've got a few different gun variants. It is interesting to say goodbye to the wrench and pistol that we started the game off with at long last and replace them with the assault rifle and this bastard. This one that said in the wrong order. It's fine. It's fine. I do wonder how much game is left. Because there's only five floors, so it mostly comes down to whether or not the game is these five floors in total or if there's some big final thing that happens. Or, for all I know, it's like, this is the first ship, and now you go to the second ship, it's twice as long. <laughs> I don't think that's the case, though. So what are we gonna get ourselves into here? Delacroix. Delacroix, it's me, Cortez. We're locked in here. Hey, who are you? Oh, shit. Well, he didn't like that. <laughs> Delacroix, it's me, Cortez. Who are you? Who are you? Shit. So he must be mistook. Interesting that he missed. He he thought I was Cortez. Can I just beat you to death? More or less. Ow. Slight damage. It happens, I suppose. But ow. Get out of here. Can't just delete you guys. Access. So that's our first goal. Find deck crew five card. Your, 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 your colleagues have managed to set up a transmitting station in the athletic sector of this deck. The transmitter is intended, is intended to send a message to the earth to warn them of the events that have occurred in this ship. However, it will also draw power away from Xerxes, making him vulnerable, vulnerable to my will. Once you do this, I will control the primary data loop. Data loop. The analids are unaware of its presence, but guard the area for their own purposes. Find, find, find the transmitter and activate it. I don't like the freaking s hives. Ah! Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna have to destroy where you come from now, because you're a pest to me. Die. That's what you get, apparently. Damage surgical unit. Should I repair this? You know what? It's right by the elevator. Let's do it. No? Is it two damage? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Is that the takeaway here is I can't do that? So a damaged one doesn't count. I have to find like an incomplete one, don't I? Unresearched object. Yee. Yeah. Yee yeah, yee yeah, yee yeah. That requires nothing. Neat. That problem's gonna take care of itself. Monkey! Ah. I'm continually astonished by how close I can be without without and miss. Oh, I should turn that into a nanite, right? There we go. Just gotta adjust my aiming angle. Oh, hey. That's kind of a big deal to find immediately. Oh, and these probably work, huh? Yeah! Yeah! Go away. There we go. What the heck? Oh, an EMP rifle. Um... Right, I can't really loot you, can I? What do you require? Energy 6? Psh! As if. Yeah, this is the- this is what I was looking for before. 
Now I can heal. Yay. Okay, Delacroix. Yang and I have got the transmitter almost ready to go. Once it's up and running, we'll be able to warn Earth. Frank split up the transmitter code and uploaded it to a number of art display terminals throughout this deck. Just cycle through the art and you'll find a piece of the code. I don't think the worms will spot this. I don't figure they got much of an interest in the great masters. Everything's just completely screwed across the board at this point. I don't even know if I have a team to root for, it's just... I'm sort of just going by the motions of what's left for me to do. In the nightmare scenario. On we go! Now this reminds me of Perfect Dark levels for sure. At least the style of wall and everything. Uh, why the spiders though? I don't like the spiders. Holy crap, I, can, I cannot hit them, can I? One shot kills. Dang. This... this thing is no joke. That's such a huge gap in effectiveness compared to a gun. Like any of the guns I really have when it comes to fighting spiders. Taking what I can. Hacking time. There we go. Six armor-piercing bullets, I'll take it. Aha! And what did we learn today? Swarm pod organ? Oh right, it's, it's an organ from the specific one that spe actually spits out the uh, swarm. Annelid swarms cannot be damaged by any known means, but have a very short lifespan. Annelid eggs often contain useful organs if you search them before they are destroyed. Although small, the flying organisms generated by these pods contain a complex DNA structure indicative of a much more advanced creature. Each small creature, genetically male, is bonded to the swarm via a sub link. This link is impervious to normal psionic attacks or disturbances. Annelid swarm creatures seem to exist only as a living weapon, since their cells have a genetically programmed lifespan of no more than a few seconds. During these seconds, they are attracted to human tissue as they frantically attempt to prolong their short lives with nourishment. The eggs that these emerge from often contain organs that might, might be extracted for useful purposes, unless the egg was destroyed in combat. Recommendation, the annelid swarm is best dealt with by avoidance, since the creatures will die soon after being hatched. Do not waste ammunition on them. Okay. Okay. What was the point of this, though? Huh. What if I click on it? Nothing! Oh, I have to get rid of that one first. So I can't do anything- okay. Get out of here. I guess. Am I crazy? I feel like every time I do research it tells me what the re thing is for. Like, um... Yeah, th this implant heals you and stuff like that. Like, or like this gives you bonus psi. Yeah. Oh, maybe it's saying that now the eggs will contain... I think I think I just boosted my loot uh, drop rate when I interact with the egg swarms. Uh, the egg the egg sacs, I mean. I was, I, was, I was like, what the hell did I actually gain from my research? The eggs we found near the observation chambers are different from the ones in Hydro. They release some kind of disgusting flying swarming thingies. Bullets don't do anything. Bullets, for Christ's sake, I never even fired a gun before this morning. Eh, she said thingies. Kind of undercuts the tension a little bit in the moment. Okay, so that'll take that'll take me somewhere else, right? Completely new chunk of map. So I should probably check out. Yeah. The other side of the hall. No, that's where I came from too, huh? Never mind. That's that's where I came from. So we've been through that door. I guess this is the only way to go, huh? Unless I missed a turn somewhere that I'm forgetting right now. That was a surprisingly quick transition to a new screen. 
But we need to find it. We need to find a key card so I can get to the other part of where I just was. Screw you. You ain't having none of your alarms. Hello, floating corpse. How do you do today? Well, she didn't exactly last. Ah! No! That's a... That's what you call a bad. That's bad. I was like, I was like, where's your loot hole? Oh crap, right, you're not a canister. You're not an adorable, harmless canister, you're a murder gun, full of murder. That's really just a bad plan. There we go. I don't know why I was trying to conserve armor pierce. I don't know, I took a hit though. Let's maybe repair real quick. Cause I gave myself an option for this exact scenario now. Where was it? <laughs> There we go. There we go. He uses five nanites for healing. I have almost 400. It's not exactly a shallow pool, so I might as well use it. Thank goodness for quick loading times. Almost instantaneous. Hello, floating lady. What were your dreams? What? Ah, no. That was a waste, too. Hi there. Dang it. I hit him at point blank range, but didn't make contact correctly. Frustrating. No. Dang it, I totally didn't see that one either. Ah. That's bad. Oh no, I haven't been saving. Damn, goddamn security cameras. <laughs> did I see did I ever see a hacking spot in here back? I don't think I did. Uh, let's start this episode over. So upon revisiting, there is an alternate path to take, because when I got that one corpse where the uh, where Shodan started narrating, uh, I could have gone right back there. So there's more to keep track of back there. Good to know. Ah, crap. Oh, you got me. That's not how grenades work. Babies must rest? Why is this the one who does not awaken them? Leave this place now, or we will wound you. As you have us. Wow. Some of these hacking spots are getting a little harder, huh? Well, ain't this place a mess? There's the security spot. I'm, not, I'm a little underwhelmed by how, ha how hacking works in this game a little bit. As far as I can tell, the best you can do is make them kind of ignore you. I think I prefer... If I was going to invest points in this, I, I probably would... Like, retroactively, I probably would not go as far into hacking as I ended up going. Because uh, I kind of went into it as just an idea of like, Oh, I'll be a hacker! Just based on a vague idea of like a game I've never played before. And was just kind of feeling my way through it. We can use you if we want to. So I, 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 I like the idea of being a hacker, but uh, in practice, I've, I've found the applications underwhelming because one of the primary things is you can make you can make those things ignore you, and I'm like that's not very exciting. I like the uh, Bioshock system where you hack something and then it turns to being on your team and it fights all the bad guys for you and stuff like that. 
I don't think that's necessarily how it works here. Is that a... Yep, it's a Psy Hypo. Slowly building up our stuff. Gotta be so careful moving that around or I'm gonna screw up and... and, uh, lose something. Yes, maintenance tools. How many of those do I have now? Six. Not a ton. Something, though. Can you be recycled? Yes. Can you all be recycled? Just every gar can every single garbage item be recycled? Oh my goodness. They all have so much more purpose all of a sudden. Although it's a really slow and tedious way of getting resources. But now that I know it's, it exists, now we're going to overuse it. I can hear one nearby. Oh, he's probably upstairs. Okay. I'll go for the audio log in a bit. I just want to keep, take care of the threats that are around here. We'll try upstairs then. And yep. Hi there. There we go. No more background growling from you. Why did I do- yeah, why did I pick up either of those things? I can't recycle those kinds of objects at the very least. This room serve a purpose? Not really. In this kind of situation, I usually expect them to head somewhere, really. Does it go higher? No, it doesn't. Down we go! I suppose it's, it's another place to find one of these guys, which is kind of a big deal to find, I think. One. So I need to piece- oh, that's what it might have- that's the purpose it might have served. Is there might be an art piece up here? No. Never mind. I'm only more puzzled. Okay, so one. It's part of the code. Can you also be recycled? Oh my goodness. I can delete every single random cosmetic thing in the environment. And cigarettes. And turn them into money. I've been working on dealing with all the bodies that have been stacking up. With the med base full and the escape pods and injection tubes mysteriously locked up all of a sudden, we've got to do something with them. I've chosen the maintenance tunnel underneath the garden as an internment site. Keypad code 34093. I'm telling everyone to be careful. I don't trust the dead. Got ourselves a code. The maintenance tunnel under the garden. 34093. Okay. Under the garden. Keep that one in mind. You know, you, audience, person I can't hear. <laughs> Could repair it. Do I want to? Actually, can I repair it? Uh, battery, surgical maintenance, medical kit. I don't remember if I have a repair. Oh, right, these guys. Yeah, I don't know if that's worth repairing a... I don't know if that's worth it for a vending machine. It's rough. You don't know what the vending machine is going to have in the first place, which is weird, because generally you can tell what's in a vending machine. If I knew what was in it, then that might uh, change my opinion on what I should do with it. No cameras in here? Bad time, frankly. Oh god. Wow. This game sometimes really punishes you for looking at any sort of interactive story elements that they throw your way. It's like, oh look, it's a ghost lady playing a piano. It's a trap for samurai robots. Not samurai. So what about down here? Sort of an earlier fork I haven't checked. Hello. Where are we going with this one? 
Oh, there was a ladder? Oh. Kind of hurt myself needlessly, I suppose. Maybe I can turn this all into healing. Is that a surgical or No, a medical kit. Items dropped. Nanites. Speaking of nanites. Bing, 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 bing. So instead of going back to where I died, I just kind of went down a different branch of the environment to take a look at that. So there may be a jump cut later when I'm like, oh, let's get through this part I've been to before. I don't know. I shouldn't have done this. This is exactly what I try not to do. Ah, shit. Your own kind sees you as a threat. Why do you murder our unity? No matter. The line is drawn. You will cease to be. It's just a question of who will bring your end. Us. You get used to a compulsion to kill things in games. And then you realize, oh yeah, it doesn't do anything now. And I can't get loot from it. Ow. Oh. Does killing that help? Really? Necessary? Die. Any alien life, apparently. Is there anything down here besides shitty egg sacks of pain? Leave me alone! I can barely move in here. Yeah. Uh. Go away! No! You dead yet? That wasn't very nice. That wasn't very nice at all. That's one of those things that makes me think, let's just shoot all the egg sacks and not deal with the hassle. You guys can cringe all you want. Ain't interested. What is that? Hazard suit? Same as always? I suppose I might need it going forward here, and at the moment my armor- my power is draining my armor. Which I can repair with batteries, but... I think I need the suit for this. Is that the point? I don't remember if that stuff hurts you or not. Ice pick. What do you do again? Oh, it's the Psy organ, right. Are you the upgrade item? Limited power supply and custom program nanites allow for one successful hack. Regardless of skill to use- Right, it's a free hack. Well, might as well use it. It's probably not gonna turn into a lot of nanites when I bring it down. So it's not- so the amount of, uh... The amount of nanites saved by... Using it is probably greater than the amount of nanites I would get from... Eating it. Converting it, I mean. Come on, get the ladder. Now where am I? Ooh, cyber modules. Welcome. I think I'll switch back. Not sure what this... If that suits for anything here, I don't... Not really sure what. Maintenance hatch opened. Neat. Huh. Now where am I? Hey! We looped around. Neat. That code might have opened it? Oh yeah, the tunnel underneath. We talked about the tunnel underneath. That's probably the code that leads to it. Okay. The more you know. Ah, uh, yeah! Deserved it. I'm going to go repair myself. It's been a little while. Just as a quality of life thing, let's go ahead and drop. Whoa. Yeah, that looks real. That's fine. Just dropping our suit by the entrance, because it takes up a, a chunk of inventory. What do you have in store for me, shitty elevator? Sorry, shitty... Piano. <laughs> elevator. These open? Oh, it's just a little bathroom. Are you, did you guys ambush me from in here? That's weird. This one doesn't open. I bet they came out of that. Can I avoid Piano Girl? No. She still gets activated.
Come on out, you little bastards. Holy crap, they're fast. <laughs> well, that worked out. All you have to do is die first, and then you can react to the thing that killed you retroactively and win. Can I jump up there? Oh! Oh, no fall damage. Not what I was going for, though. Nah. Oh, right. Ficus is... Ficus is consumed. You can consider these ficuses owned. Is it like a broken elevator or what? I'm hearing a lot of background robo noises that don't really give me a lot of hope. A little concerned about that. The analysts have cut us off from the transmitter. Shodan tells me that once we've got the transmitter back online and the ops computers reprogrammed, she'll be able to take control of the ship away from Xerxes. Who should I trust less? An imposter claiming to be that monster, or the monster herself? That's interesting. That's interesting. Yep, yeah, she's screwed. She's also, like, the longest lasting character in the game, it seems like. She refuses to die. She's been on every single floor so far, basically, I think. I wonder if I can clear that? Heh? Oh, that's cool. I just jumped in through a window. I want to know if I can make it to this. Ah. Uh, yeah, it kind of seemed unlikely. Oh. Another one. Gotta be real careful. I'm always so close to destroying something that's actually useful when I'm using that. There we go. Yeah, they totally came out of here. What, is it? what am I supposed to think of those holes? The heck? Did they, am I supposed to think they burrowed through the wall or something? Or is there just chunks in here? That's a weird sight. That's a real grister and weird sight. Quick save. Okay. Am I, am I supposed to do anything around here besides leaving? The jump just doesn't seem feasible, right? Yeah, I'm not really putting a lot of stock on that. Maybe I'll get a chance to activate the elevator from a different direction. Maybe even, maybe, maybe even basically just around the corner. Just kind of thought they might be all over the place now. Welcome to the dining area. Another bathroom, huh? Don't trust the bathrooms. They're one of my primary sources of death so far. Do I hear a camera? There isn't one here? Alright, so we still only have one number of the code. Let's avoid that door for a little bit. Check over here. Oh, shit. Jesus. Fighting those guys sucks. They're just like right in your face. They're super fast, super dangerous. And I'm more like, hmm. <laughs> My crappy swinging blade. These doors. You gotta like rub your face on them. I guess that one just doesn't open. The other one you had to touch so much to open that it's hard to tell now. Am I gonna get ambushed again down here? Is that a bad idea? It feels like a bad idea.
Oh, we've got a lot of points for my next level up at this point. They definitely scale up their output over time. Did, ch did changing the lights affect anything, though? Does the door open, for example? But why would the why would that affect that? Who would want their light switches to affect whether or not their doors are powered? Ah, <laughs> oh, I can't pick up any of these things and turn them <laughs> peas in maze. Yep, maze is a good game. You can't pick up any of the things and turn them into nanites. It's just a kitchen, huh? Can I climb this, at least? You don't need ducting. Listen, we make our own fun. That's the real takeaway. You hiding things from me back here? They're not. Surprisingly often, they're not hiding anything from me in a lot of these areas. There's been some surprisingly vacant locales. Where am I? This is still new, right? Yeah. What's up with the shapes of these hallways and stuff? Items dropped. Am I really that low on space now? I guess so. Yep, that's our life now. <laughs> Listen, there's one escape pod Xerxes didn't eject, but it's busted. I managed it functional, but I don't know how long it can stay that way. Make it there, Tommy, with or without me. If I don't get there, I want you to let go. You understand me? Take it and go. A lot of heroic sacrifices in this bunch. Alright, so we definitely don't want to encounter bad guys like that with uncharged armor. Or lacking in health, so let's... Use that real quick. It doesn't even fully charge it. Oh. Oh well. I guess I'll just use them up and then I'll be out of them. 